In the last video we told you about weapons in Tanky X. Now it's time to look into the selection of hulls. Today we'll give you a brief overview of each hull and then we'll tell you about how each of them will be made unique. Let's start. A hull is a tank's basis upon which a turret is installed. In Tanky X there will be seven hulls, all different from one another visually, as well as in terms of speed, maneuverability and protection. To make it simpler, let's divide them into three categories – light, medium and heavy ones. The light hulls are Wasp and Hornet. They are compact, fast and nimble battle machines with a modest health pool. Destroying a light hull is easy if you manage to hit it. The range of medium hulls consists of three tanks. These are Hunter, Viking and Titan. Mediums are average in size, pretty maneuverable and quick, with armor that can survive several serious hits. All in all, they are as versatile as you can get, suitable for all situations, but not spectacular in any of them. These hulls are a perfect choice for a beginner or for a tanker who prefers not to stick to a single rail on the battlefield. Viking deserves a special mention here, as it is the lowest hull in the game, making it almost impossible to flip over or knock off its aim. And finally, heavy hulls, Dictator and Mammoth. These hulls have the best protection in the game, which, however, is balanced out by their slow speed and modest maneuverability, which makes them best suited for defense and support. By the way, Dictator has another serious advantage in addition to its excellent armor. It is the tallest of the hulls. This means the majority of its shots hit the enemy's turret, allowing it to easily knock off an opponent's aim. Light hulls can even be flipped over. What's interesting is that hull models are animated. For example, activating a double armor supply will cover the sides of your tank with additional armor plates, while enabling a nitro will open up the engine compartment, which heats up to extreme temperatures. And yeah, these visual effects are unique for each of the seven hulls. Sounds are equally important. Hull engines will sound differently depending on class. You'll never confuse an approaching wasp with a crawling mammoth. And probably the most important thing. Each hull in Tanky X won't just look and sound different. It will also give you a unique feel when driving it. Our main task is to make each tank behave differently.